My name is Stephen Hunter. Um, I'm from Ardoin. I'm a community activist, uh, coach for Ardoin GA, Ardoin Kettles, the, the local GA club. Um, grew up in Ardoin, and I'm a player manager and coach for Ardoin for the past 25 years. I think I'm catered for all ages, from two, three, four years of age, right up until senior level. They would cover most GA sports, they even have a local handball lobby. There's been a few all Ireland champions that come out of the GA in handball. There's a lot of um, work goes on behind the scenes regarding kids and children. And it's always been like the heart of the community to try and give um, local kids um, get themselves involved in sport in the GA. Like any, any GA club in Ireland, they would try and get a community based where families are involved. My father used to play for the club and um, most, most of my friends who play with and coach with their parents were involved in the club, some stayed at them. I would even go as far as to say that most kids in Ardoin have played for Ardoin GA at some stage in their lives. The best part of my career now as a coach was getting a minor team to the final back in 2009, which was lost by a point or two, which was disappointing. But getting there and experiencing for the young, young lads of the community, experiencing that, getting their final was, was good. So it's always good to get, to get trophies in the cabinet and it picks not only the club up, but sometimes it picks a community as a whole. Growing up in Northern Ireland, I'm, I'm actually looking at the, the school I went to, Rehenia, Holy Cross. Um, grew up in the 70s and the 80s and 90s. And to, to put it in one word, it was tough as a, as a youngster, but you wouldn't have knew any different. Growing up, you thought it was all natural, it was like cowboys and Indians, but there's a lot of, when you look back, when you, when you get older, you, 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 you say only then when you realise how dangerous it was just to even go to school in the morning. I can see that um, the young people now have a lot more opportunities. A generation beforehand, it was about trying to stay alive and get ahead in life. Now, these days, it's the social issues, the problems, housing, jobs. It's a lot of um, pressures on them to succeed in life or to get it right. There's a lot of young, young people who have committed um, suicide, which is a big, big issue in the community. And it's, it's very, very important that you have local people, people who grew up who know what the needs of the local kids is.